but I'm not expecting then anything for Christmas. Uh, let's see, uh, holiday spending. Where was I? Oh, yes. Uh, the average person will spend almost $1,100 during the holiday season, including $637 on gifts, 215 bucks on food, decoration, flowers, and greeting cards, and another $155 on non-gift purchases because some deals are too good to pass up. That's from uh, the National Retail Federation. And here's an easy way to ease your aches and pains. Step outside. You heard me. I don't care if you're in Chicago or wherever and it's colder than hell. Simply get outside and enjoy the crisp, fall air because it'll dial back the pain. That's according to the University of Pittsburgh scientists. Spending just 20 minutes a day in natural surroundings also leads to a 65% increase in focus and a 50% boost of energy. That's from Woman's World magazine. God, they know everything. Seriously, they really do. Woman's World magazine knows it all. Just ask a woman. And uh, finally, there's no other way to say this. This is a real shitty job. Our sympathies go out to the parents of newborns. Most experts will tell you that a baby will go through between 2,500 to 3,000 diapers in their first year. That's a crappy job. The SuburbanMom.com has that information in case you want to double-check my math, and make sure I'm telling you the truth. Where's the rest of my stuff? Had it here a minute ago. Oh, here it is. Let's see. uh, Next time on GOAFS, Get an Old Ink for Sissies, that'd be episode 55. If you're keeping track... Ooh, this looks like it's going to be a good show. He who smelt it, dealt it. Is it that long? No way. Show me. Got a psychopath in the family? I'll tell you how to spot one. And letters to Santa are a fraud by the United States Postal Service. Spread it around. Tell a kid. Ruin their day. (laughs) I would. If I knew a little kid. Go ahead, write a letter to Santa. It's all a big fake. Uh, That's coming up on episode 55. That's November 29th. Just right around the corner. G-O-A-F-S is getting old, ain't for sissies. Introducing Netflix Dating, the app that finds you a mate the same way you find a show. Based on your interest in beer and hair bands, we recommend Deb, a roadie for a Motley Crue cover band. Simply enter your dating history and we'll find you a match made in heaven. Based on your interest in tattoos and running, we recommend Spider, an ex-con who just got paroled. Let's face it, you spend so much time watching Netflix that you'll probably die alone. But you don't have to with Netflix. Netflix Dating, the app that can find a mate for any situation. Based on your interest in straight men who watch Bravo. 
Hi, folks. Thanks for listening to the old hipster Tom Rivers and getting old ain't for sissies. Tom focuses on things you may not find on the radio when it comes to the aging process. Tuesday and Thursday night, 7 p.m. Central. Tom's lived it, so he knows what to pass on to you, like relationship advice for those over 60, how to get a good night's sleep, treat your body better by eating better, how to be happy again, and how to avoid stress. Plus, every now and then, Tom will touch on some touchy items in the news. Tom's Getting Old Ain't for Sissies can be found on Spotify, SoundCloud, Tumblr, Twitter, YouTube, Google+, and Tom's personal Facebook page. Please remember, on any of those media platforms, please click either like or favorite so Tom gets credit for his work. Thanks again. In Chicago, I'm Doug Dahlgren. Thanks for coming, and good night. Good night.